So what can we expect with today's weather, Mary? Will we have some nice weather to at least experience that? Well, there's definitely going to be some breaks from really the clouds. You're going to have some sunshine. A lot of that rain that we had this morning, it is moving out. But later on, around 3 o'clock, especially for areas north, you're going to see the risk for some storms first. And then by later on into the afternoon, that risk is going to shift to the south. So Latrobe, the air show, just keep an eye to the sky and make sure that you have the weather app so that if you do get any alerts to your phone, you can pause and stay safe. 62 degrees right now winds out of the south south east five miles per hour. We do have a lot of that rain just staying to our south at the moment. We do have a little bit of some light rain showers making their way into parts of Beaver County, but certainly not a washout at the moment. These can just be dodged. I don't even think you need the umbrella, but we are looking at the risk of for some isolated strong to severe storms, which means they will be hit or miss. So some areas not going to see rain throughout this afternoon, but all of us are at a risk for those storms. So that's a one out of five for our severe weather risk. Most of this will be at the surface as we see just a burst of energy move in. So damaging winds, even some potential hail that'll be between about three and even eight o'clock. So if you're headed to the Three Rivers Arts Festival, make sure you're staying weather aware, have the umbrella with you. And again, you'll want your KDK weather app on hand. Looking at our UV forecast, if you're going to be out and about today during the dry time, it's going to be high between 10 and 6 o'clock. Burn time 20 minutes. Grab the hat, the sunglasses, the sunscreen, fine shade. It's going to be very hot the next couple of days. So today is the most comfortable day of the week. Surprisingly, it's going to get a little bit muggy and then extremely humid by midweek. And I nudge the numbers up just a little bit as new models are updating. So looking at our future cast timing it out for you by 3 o'clock areas north of I 80. Yellow indication are some pockets of heavier rain. This is where we could see a few maybe Maybe even severe thunderstorm warnings popping up and then seven o'clock this evening. We'll see that for Butler also places like Indiana and then places like Cranberry and even Greensburg. And then as convection dies down, those will diminish. Now here's the next round late Monday night, eight o'clock. We're looking at heavy rain that's going to be moving in with the front now. This is mostly going to be while you're sleeping, so not too big of an impact, but a lot of this could even wake you up, wake your kids up. Have your dog scared because there will be some heavy downpours and even some thunder and lightning along with it by Tuesday. We're going to be quiet, but it's going to be very, very hot. So temperatures tonight right around 60. We do have the chance again for those showers later on this evening and then tomorrow night we're looking at showers and storms, but there will be sunshine even for our Monday, especially starting off Tuesday. Very early rain and storms and then we'll be drying out, but I bumped it up to 92 on Wednesday. That's not the record high. 90 isn't the record on Thursday, but whether we get to 89, 90, 91, 92, it's still going to be very uncomfortable and you're going to want to find ways to stay cool and stay hydrated in this heat because it's going to be one of those days, typical summer like pattern where you have sunshine, sun will fuel those storms and then we could see those pop up by Friday, 83 degrees, partly cloudy. Then I'm really looking forward to Saturday. Beautiful, sunny and seasonable.